everyone, welcome back to another video. Today is a special one in that it is the seasonal event for the 2019 All Saints Week. And as you can see, Claire looks amazing and ready to go. She looks so adorable, doesn't she? Like a little pumpkin witch. In fact, that's what I'm going to call it, a pumpkin witch. So here we are in Gridania about to accept the All Saints Wake event quest, which is called Fear and Delight. And it's just outside the amphitheater here. We earn the Circus Resonator, too, as the reward, a metal tuning fork that, when struck, emits an almost comically eerie tone, which opens a temporary rift in the void, allowing your Circus RMN to pass through to this plane. The Adventures Guild investigator is deeply suspicious about... something. Aha! I spy with my keenest of eyes she who thwarted the evils of yesteryear. What a pleasant surprise it is to see you again. Would that I could say the same for that lot. The Continental Circus, you see, has arrived once again, as it does every year when it comes time for All Saints Wake, bringing ghosts and pumpkins and all manner of reverie to Eorzea. I suspect, however, that the troop is planning something rather more sinister than the distribution of sweet treats. They're fell fiends in disguise, you understand. It's just what they do. I've been unable to discern the nature of their vile plot as yet, but I am certain that something is afoot. Thus do I ask that you assist in my investigation. I need you to speak with the Impresonaro, learn what manner of entertainment the troop is offering this year, and perhaps trick him into revealing something of what they're really planning. I will continue to observe the other members for any sign of suspicious behavior." So we get to go speak with the pumpkin-headed idiot. I mean, he's really an imp in disguise. Ooh, spoiler, sorry. A horrifying All Saints wake to you, Traveler! But yours is a face that I have seen before. My, it is always such a pleasure to see a soul that so appreciates All Saints Wake. Oh, All Saints Wake, those unhallowed nights where we may feast and frolic, free from prying saintly eyes. Mortals once feared it, it is true, hiding from the creatures that stalk the shadows. But now... Now it is perfectly safe! All the better to cast your cares aside and enjoy the devilish surprises our troop has prepared for the occasion. Why, they're positively dreadful, if I do say so, my... Oh! Impresonaro! It's dreadful! Dreadful, I say! I raised that armament myself, care for it ever since it was a BDI, newly torn from the void by an unscrupulous peddler of exotic pets. And now it's deserted me. I feel so betrayed. Do you mean to say that the circus armament has gone missing? I suppose you do, as we've only the one. This is troubling indeed. My dear lady, might I ask you to aid us in searching for the missing creature? I hate to think of what might become of it, were it to be spotted by one who, er, uh, mistook it for an agent of evil. Alright, I'll help. How dreadfully kind of you. Now, were I an Ammerman, though I most certainly am not, I believe that I might find the crowds of the city intimidating, in which case we had best turn our gaze upon the surrounding wilds instead. Perhaps the central shroud to begin with. It can't have gotten far. So let's head out to the central shroud and see if we can find our future new mount. I wonder if we're going to be seeing the white pumpkin-headed lady again. For those of you who don't know, every year we get like this great gourd, like this lady with a white pumpkin on her head. So I'm not entirely sure what she is or what part she has to play in all this. They say that she is supposed to be like this great pumpkin, I suppose, who when she finally awakes, she will lead like this army of void sense who I don't know, conquer the world or something. At least that was kind of the impression that I got. But anyway, uh, she's much more friendly than these guys like us to believe, and she's actually helped us out on several times during each one of the All Saints Wake events. There! And, oh wait, look! It looks like she is here after all! Oh, he's cute! So, there she is, this great pumpkin, I suppose. It's been a long time. Oh, 
I know you. I know you well. Are you acquainted with this little one? Not really. I was just asked to find him. It tells me that it's been working with the circus, but it struggles to satisfy the impresionaro's demands. Oh, sweetheart, you're not a disappointment, and your eye is charming. Yes, it is. Perhaps you are somewhat different, but that's nothing to feel ashamed of. Isn't that right, hero? Um, sure. And Presenaro, over here! Ah, you found it! But why did the two of you not return right away? Ah, she disappeared again. We were talking to someone a moment ago. A mysterious figure who comes and goes at will. Why, that sounds to me like the ogre Pumpkinhead, the one who ushers in the Knight of Devilry. Hi, Jess, of course. The ogre Pumpkinhead would hardly break her silence after all these years to speak with you. Excuse me? Er, uh, what I mean, of course, is that the Great Gourd is merely a fable. If she were real, and I'm sure she would be delighted, no honor to snow you, as are we all. My, you possess a spectacularly spine-chilling glare. It's enough to terrorize a void scent. I mean, it would be, I assume. In fact, it's so very horrific that, were one seeking to train in the art of the Dread Gaze, there could be no better instructor, not even amongst fiends. And as it happens, we are in need of such a tutor. We at the Continental Circus have standards to maintain, you see. To play a part in the troupe, one must be able to project a certain air of eeriness, all in the name of delighting the public, of course. Alas, our friend here's gaze is somewhat less than dreadful, which simply will not do, particularly for an armament. man. I'm sure you understand. Under your tutelage, however, it may yet become a valued member of the circus. Well, why not? Marvelous! Then it's decided. Our armament man shall be your pupil. Oh, he looks so happy. I suppose you will need to learn to ride it if you're going to train it properly, though. Come, I'll show you. And once you mold it into a monster that inspires the deepest dread, a force for evil that renders even the most stalwart of mortals voiceless and trembling, our true work will begin. We shall usher in the Night of Devilry at long last, Recall the great gourd from her slumber, and feast as the world cowers before us! He really is an idiot. He, that can't possibly work. I think their plans are getting more desperate and stupid year by year. But hey, I'm not complaining, they have really cool stuff. The Armament is well trained, or at least I thought so until it ran off on me. <clears throat> In any case, it ought to bear you as a passenger without objection. I ask that you help it practice gazing upon unsuspecting fools until it gets the hang of doing so. Dreadfully. When it has learned to perform to your satisfaction, please accompany it back here to me. I should hate to be abandoned by my own Armament. Again. I understand that it is a bit brown, so if you fall off, return to me and I will help you reset yourself. Now up you go. Oh, look at that! That is so cute! Oh, and look! It makes like a little happy pumpkin face! Already I like this one than the other armament mount we have. Oh, I love him. All right, let's see what he can do. Babaka feed, or you shall taste my blade. 
Oh, that was rather festive, actually. And that hat, it's fantastic. Dear me, I had nearly forgotten about the All Saints wait season was upon us. Fiend's Lane can wait. I must don my guys post haste. Ah, good for him. Now ah, let's go find two others. It looks like, and nope, not this way. This way. You know, after playing Shadowbringers, and we kind of know like the whole truth of what the Void Scents actually are. Like, I can't help but wonder if maybe we'll get some Sin Eaters someday. Like, Sin Eater mounts. That would be cool. Woo! Oh my, what an adorable giant eyeball you are! And dress for All Saints Wake too. I wish I were celebrating instead of training out here. Slay three squirrels, they said. It'll be a challenge, they said. You know what? I'm done here. I'm going back to town to stuff myself with pumpkin cookies. <laughs> That's kind of how I feel every Halloween. Like, I don't want to work. I just want to go out and eat cookies and treats all night. Ah, well, that was weird of you, but you won't scare me away from my hunting spot that easily. Oh, you're at the Continental Circus. What a coincidence. I love All Saints Wake. I'm out here hunting for dermite webs to decorate my cottage for the occasion, in fact. But if the festivities have already begun, I must hurry back to Gridania. I would hate to miss a single ghost or void scent or spider. That looks like all three. I think he's gotten the hang of it. Let's head back. Though we weren't really much of a tutor for him, were we? <laughs> do do do. Do 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 Right up the bridge. Here we are. You must have been terrifying. I saw three people running at such speeds that they could only have been desperate to reach the safety of their homes. Extraordinary! I'm ever so slightly offended that the armor men seems to have responded better to your training than mine, but what matters is that it has proven itself useful. We can only hope that this is enough to satisfy the impresonaro. I don't think either of us could stand another lecture of the fundamentals of fear. In any case, he ought to be informed of your progress immediately. He doesn't like to be kept waiting. Ah, uh, once again, it seems that we have another short quest. I mean, they shouldn't have, like, a series of quests, like, every year. Make it a little bit more interesting. Make it so that we don't want to rush through it just so we can get the prizes. I mean, I never rush through these quests. I know a lot of people do, but I never do because, I mean, you wait all year for these. You might as well enjoy it. But these stories are just getting shorter and less fun every time. I think they should just hire people specifically to work on these seasonal events and special events. Just work specifically to make these quests as fun as possible. At least that's my opinion.
but we should hurry back and see how we end up keeping the armament mount. We're back! Did you miss us? Ah, you've returned! How did the armament fare in its lessons? Splendidly! It sent not merely one, but three souls hastening home to quiver under their blankets. It has clearly learned to wield its dread gaze. Um, yeah! In a manner of speaking. No need to be modest. If its gaze has become even half as horrific as yours, I have no doubt that it is capable of chilling victim to the bone. And you, young armor men, congratulations! You have proven yourself to be a worthy member of the troop. Go forth and terrorize the masses! You traitorous little... You want to go with her? Hmm, I'm not certain we can afford to part with such a valuable asset. On the other hand, so long as it continues to terrify, it needn't necessarily remain here to be of assistance. In fact, traveling would bring it into contact with even more victims. Very well, I am moved by your heartfelt plea, Armaman. I will permit you a leave of absence, so long as you continue to emulate your horrifying companion. Guide it well, adventurer. I look forward to seeing what horrors you visit upon the realm. Sure. My foolish children, ever eager to reclaim what has never truly been lost. It steadily takes a different form, but the night goes on, haunted by monster and mortal both. And though you may think me absent, my eye is ever upon you. So do have fun. Aw, <laughs> oh, well, that looks like a fun night. I leave our armament in your sinister hands. Yeah, I mean, these guys are really dense, aren't they? But hey, if they weren't, we never would have gotten so many cool stuff over the years. You returned at last. Did you uncover any unhallowed plots? Kind of. I don't think we need to worry, though. They attempted to train an armament to terrorize the populace? But it's your friend now? Well, as long as it poses no risk to others, I don't see the harm in it accompanying you. Though I will make a note of this in the guild records, just in case. I appreciate your willingness to get hands-on with this investigation. Speaking of which, for my part, I have observed the troop moving large quantities of supplies and issuing invitations to some manner of gathering. Based on past experience, I cannot help but have a bad feeling about this. Oh, looks like we have another quest waiting for us. Haunting Grounds. But you know what? I think that we'll end it there. We can do the other quests in the next video. And we have our brand new mount to play with. Oh, yay. So we can summon the Circus Armament mount, which is amazing. But like I said, we'll end it there. And I hope you're looking forward to the next video for All Saints Wake. So until then.